mom the e-bear and today i am going garbage hunting it is dumpster diving monday and i will be going to a whole new neighborhood because the um old area that i was dumpster diving in seemed to have a lot of competition there so i'm going to go ahead and check out this other um upscale neighborhood and i'll see how things go there so guys um as you can see if you look out my window here we are not having a good day here um, in the town that I live in. So I have to do my dumpster diving in the rain, but that's okay because I'm used to working in um, extreme weather conditions. You gotta do what you gotta do when you need to make money, right? So I um, will just have to survive. So guys, let me go ahead and get started and I will keep posted. Guys, real quick, I wanted to show you how my breakfast is in the morning when I go out uh, dumpster diving. I usually have me a thing of almonds, my water, and my vitamins. This is what keeps me going throughout the day. I know this is not a, a, a you know a traditional breakfast. However, this is what I eat because I am always on the go and moving and trying to, to find the perfect find. I tend to skip out on uh, food and just wanted to show you guys you know um, how I eat as a picker so don't tear my head off because I know some people are very big on having a nutritious bre nutritious breakfast but unfortunately guys I am about to hustle and this is what I eat so um, I just wanted to show you guys that I know you probably don't give two dams but hey just wanted to show you anyway. alright guys I am um currently at my destination the new neighborhood that I was telling you about me personally I have a, a, a secret here I hate dumpster diving on um property that have the garbages on the outside I prefer doing it inside of an alleyway that way the people won't see me doing it but usually when it's um, out in the open like this it's embarrassing but you know I, I have to make a, a living somehow and if I have to do it you know with the garbages on the outside I have to do what I have to do but I prefer doing it with the garbages on the inside Ah, there's a new kid on the block Caden Bradley it's a boy Oh, look at him how cute what we got here Couldn't get it. Turn it. Couldn't get in there like I wanted to. Plus, it's so wet out here. Because it did rain here, so let's see. And it's a Blu ray disc. We shall see. Alright, guys, because I am having so much trouble trying to find garbage today, I guess due to the weather, I've decided to detour and go inside of this um, church resale shop. So hopefully, I find some items there, but I am not having a good day in the neighborhood today, guys. I'm Eva here, and I just wanted to show you a score that I picked up. 
from the um, thrift store here. A Detroit diesel engine manual. And I googled it. No, I'm sorry. I put it. I lit. I um, did a completed listing on eBay and it went for $100. $100, guys. I made a score. Yay! I'm still here at the um, church resale shop and I picked up a couple of items and I'll show you. I got this uh, Omni, The Minds of Nostradamus, Portrait of, Pro Pro Portrait of a Prophet. I got a Cinderella book, a Sleeping Beauty book. I also got a Cabela's, a vintage Cabela's shirt for men. I got a Joseph A. Bank uh, Traveler's Collection shirt. I thought this would be a great seller because it's extra clean and I like this stripe and this stripe is really popular this year of course I am super geeked about my Detroit diesel engine book I am like so excited about this this was really 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 a great score and I'm like so geeked that I think I want to do a happy dance Alright guys, so I have some more items that I want to show you. I saw these uh, Ralph Lauren Polo furry slipper shoes, green. They want, uh, actually they'll be $4 because today is half off day. So I thought these were cool. I also picked up these cute glittery Tom shoes for little girls. They want $3 for these. Again, it's half price day. I found these uh, cute outfits. Well, I found these, um, what are these? Pink uh, Victoria's Secret flip flops for a dollar. I found these cool looking Mickey Mouse Crocs. Um, they're asking for six. Of course, they will be three because it's half off day. And I also found this really, really huge Guess How Much I Love You book. For Haley, I've been looking all over for a big book um, for her so I can read to her at night. So that's a good score. I found these Antonio Milani slippers, ballet flats. Um, they have $8, but they will be $4. And I found me some Nine West um, shoes as well. I don't know if that says $6, but if it is, they'll be $3 with the um, leopard hair, hairy material right here. Really, really cute. So, that's all that I found. Hey guys, I think that is it. I am going to go ahead and check out. I've done enough shopping. And I've spent enough money. So, I'm going to get some free candy. Guys, I think I did pretty well today here at the um, church thrift store. I spent a total of let's see, twenty-seven dollars and nine cents, so that was pretty good. I should make, um, of course, more than um, what I spent. The profit margin should be off the chain, so we shall see. All right, guys, I wanted to say thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like. I will get back to you guys later. Thank you. Bye bye. Guys, I think I did exceptionally well today here at the church thrift store. I spent a total of, hopefully, you can see that. I spent a total of, let's see, $27.09. I should, um, I hope and I expect to double my money. And I will get back to you guys later. Let me go ahead and get back inside because it's like super windy here. At first it was raining, now it's windy. This Chicago weather is like super crazy. Alright, we're gonna do the happy dance.